Well, out we head to sunny Arizona. Uh, we're going to the Arizona Bowl, Ohio versus Wyoming, 430 on Barstool. Fun enough. Another maybe non-Disney property here. Is this a Disney property? I don't think so. Barstool's got it. Yeah, so there we go. Good for Barstool. Get yourself a bowl game. Uh, This is going to feature Ohio and Wyoming meeting up. A couple teams with some slow starts this year. Not a whole lot going on for them towards the beginning of the year, but started to kind of get some stuff figured out as the year went along. Ohio starts two and three. They realized seven straight wins and mag play to reach the conference championship game. Wyoming, they look like they might have been one of the worst teams week zero. Ended up sort of a de facto division championship game against Boise by the end of the year. Might be a little bit of a defensive slugfest. Ohio enters with the back of quarterback C.J. Harris. Wyoming is basically jealous of Iowa's passing attack and how inept they've been. So probably a low-scoring game. Maybe not a whole lot of fireworks in this one, but it'll be plenty hot in Arizona. Trey, what are we thinking here? What's the formula for success for both of these teams? Well, I think for Ohio, C.J. Harris just has to find a way to bring explosivity back to this offense. They looked really, yeah. really good under Curtis Rourke. You mentioned the seven-game win streak. They were putting up crazy numbers on offense. Curtis Rourke looked like an NFL prospect at times um, d- uh, down the stretch of this year, but he goes down with a season-ending injury. Ever since Harris has taken over, he's a young guy. He's still finding his footing, but it's just really lacked that explosivity. So... They definitely have the talent at the skill positions to get things going again. Look for the running game to hopefully pick up some of the slack because, you know, the Cowboys are not awful, but they're only 68th in the country in rush defense. So hopefully the run game can pick up some slack and CJ Harris can just find a way to bring some explosivity and consistency back to this offense. On the other side of the ball, Andrew Presley, the quarterback for Wyoming, he just has to find a way. He has the <laughs> offense has not been pretty this year. That's an nope. understatement of the year. Yep. Defense will do enough to keep the Cowboys in the game, though. I think the defense will definitely, at least early, keep the Cowboys in the game, make CJ Harris uncomfortable. And you got to capitalize that on that if you're Andrew Presley. You have to find a way to get your team down the field. Something he struggled to do all year and really all of his career. In 11 games this year, Gary, he only threw for 1,388 yards and nine touchdowns. So, if you're looking for optimism, I would point you to the run game for Wyoming, but they're looking to be without their top four running backs in this one as well. So find a way. I, I don't know what it is. I don't know what the <laughs> is, but find a way to get up and down the field if you're at Wyoming and just give your defense a break because the defense is going to perform well, but offense has to find a way to score some points. I'm missing their top four running backs. Top four running backs. Quarterback. The, what, the top guy um, – opted out for the NFL draft and right. a couple in the transfer portal, a couple injured, just not a good Man. situation for the Cowboys. That's not great, Trey. Um, not great. Let, let's see. Where are we going for a score prediction here? This one's pretty tough. Who do you think comes out on top in this one? I'm going to go with Ohio. I think they're more consistent and, you know, CJ Harris has shown flashes this year. He's shown that he can move the ball more effectively than Andrew Presley has. So I'm going to go with Ohio. I think it's a low scoring game probably somewhere to the tune of 24-10. Wow, yeah. I think I'm going to go even lower scoring than that. I will pick Ohio again. Kind of feels like by default. I'm going to go Ohio to win this one, and this one might sound like an insult. I'm going to go 14-3. to Just don't see where Wyoming has any success on offense in this one. But weird things happen in Arizona. Maybe it heats up a little bit for both teams, and this one becomes a, a massive you know, shootout somehow that we never saw coming. Stay tuned. Hopefully you stay with the channel. Not too many bowl games left to go here, so enjoy the ones that we have. And enjoy the Arizona Bowl with Barstool. Gracious, how about that?